Yo, what up? It's me, your boy Odie, and this is the morning crew. Morning crew, say hello. Everyone who's here, please say hi. Uh, we're getting ready to react to the uh, new Pokemon Presents trailer at 6 a.m. Um, on fucking Wednesday. So, I hope we're excited. Oh, yeah. <laughs> say hello to YouTube kitties. This is getting clipped. It's on there. It's great to see you. You know, real quick, if I could take a brief moment, I'm going to give a little shout out to Solner. Um, they stream as well, and their art was really cool. And I already added you to the um, shout out bot, and I'm not going to remove you, so I don't want to hear any complaints. It's too late. Boys support boys. And everyone support. Fuck, it's, all right, is that too loud? You guys, okay, I can't edit the audio on the fly, so I need you guys to tell me if this audio is good. Have a good night, Enzo, or good day. It's a little loud. Is that better? Is that better, or is that good? Okay. okay, I adjusted it just a little bit more, and that should be good. You know, Pokemon reveal ASMR with Odie. Let's go. I have no idea how long this will be or what it consists of, because it's just a Pokemon present. So unless they're really like talking about other products, and it's not just Pokemon Scarlet, which it seems like it is. Company. In today's Pokemon Presents, we will be sharing information on several of our I games. I think this is a Pokemon good volume. Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. I probably know Evolution. But I'm gonna guess that we get the middle forms for the starters. World Championships that will be held in London oh, you fuckers! They ne they always do this shit. You don't get you don't get the good news. You don't get what you want right away. Please have a look at this video. Oh, let me hide Izuki. Hello, Pokemon trainers. I'm Chris Brown from the Pokemon Company International, and I'm delighted to share with you updates on our annual Pokemon World Championships. After three years, oh, our exciting. community will come together August 18th. I don't know. I'm guessing London, there's never an evolution. Pokemon battles, but also to be together, celebrating old friendships and creating new ones. I mean, look, All statistically, more often than not, we, we don't get an evolution. From around the world yeah. Compete in this year's trading card game, video game. I'm excited to see how many new Pokemon they reveal. Like, like that's that's what I'm guessing. I'm guessing that we're gonna get some confirmation on some of the evolutions. You know, not Reggie. Beginning with two new Yeah, well, I don't think. Please join me in welcoming Pokemon Go, where nearly 100 players will compete across two age divisions, and Pokemon Unite. Where 16 teams from 11 regions will come. Wow, they really are These making like an official Pokemon Go League. To earn the title which like makes sense, but that's pretty cool. Champion in these new categories. We also have a few surprises in store for fans attending in person. Including really? our largest I ever they are. Pokemon Center World's Pop-Up Shop. For those oh, unable to attend I'm in so person, jealous. you can follow all the action from wherever you are on our dedicated live streams for each product. Including coverage of every championship match. You know what? I don't like, like although... The cards and stuff aren't my thing. Like, I'm just not into, like, the competitive side. I think it is really cool that they, like, I remember as a kid, I wanted to join a Pokemon card game league because if you were good enough, you got to be a gym leader. Yeah. Oh, wait, what? Guys, I might need to get into competitive battling. And he's holding a little trophy. We look forward to seeing you in London. And now I would like to hand it back. I can't go to, to London. I don't know anything. It's already been. I, I didn't qualify. I don't think I'm going to Worlds. There's not going to be a Worlds trophy for me. Much, <laughs> what does he have in the background? Why is Glaceon? Like everyone always tries to analyze it. I like the G Max Pikachu though. But they do have the plushies for the three starters. That's so cute. 
For the first time in three years, we held in-person Pokemon Go Fest events in Berlin and mm -hmm. Seattle. And this weekend, we will be holding an event in Sapporo, Japan. Oh, cool. Mysterious creatures known as Ultra Beasts have appeared at each event. And these Ultra Beasts will all gather together during the Pokemon Go Fest 2022 finale event. It will be held oh, on that's August cool. 27th. The finale is a global event that can be enjoyed by trainers wherever they are. That'll in the be world. cool. Hey, Jake, sir, how are you? Good to see you. Pokemon they may not normally see 3D printing, I know. Get good, Odie. I, Odie needs that fucking trophy. <gasps> special research. Will you be able to help re contend with the Ultra Beasts? No. And what has become of Professor Willow, who was sucked into Ultra Space through an Ultra Wormhole? Stay oh, tuned wait, I didn't read the quest. Completed. Fuck, I should have. Additionally, the, the opportunity to get tickets to Seattle, uh, you, you, know, you get it, you get it, Ash. Once a day and lasts for 15 minutes. It can attract Pokemon not normally seen in Yeah, but that shit doesn't work. I ain't walking around where I live. Use daily adventure incense for a 15 minute adventure every day. Over the past six years, we've seen Pokemon from Legendary. every region debut in Pokemon Go. There are now over 700 Pokemon you can register to the Pokedex. Whether you're making new friends at Pokemon Yeah, Game but is that actually 700 or is it 700 but like we're counting all the stupid ass fucking Pikachu hats? Go, and our adventures are just getting started. I mean, that's cool. It's exciting. I like Pokemon Go. And I don't play in Pokemon Unite, but Pokemon I will admit Unite, that it is kind of cool. App for Nintendo Switch and mobile devices. And mobile devices. Pokemon Unite has continued to grow and evolve since its release. Unfortunately, this video won't go live to YouTube for at least a full day because of like Twitch shit. But whatever. Oh, is the Dex entries go to over seven hundred? A new type of quick battle, Pika Party, will begin today. <gasps> that Pikachu with the hoodie and the hat, though. And this special type of quick battle I, and celebration dude, they sometimes get me on the Pikachus with the clothes. I, most of the time, I hate them. Wild and players. <gasps> the Chef Pikachu, I mean, G Max Pikachu, being the old thick boy, like that was a plushie that I wish I would have got. Those were so good. Additionally, Buzzwool will be joining Unite Battles starting today, August. I gotta, 3rd. I gotta replay. Is an um, Ultra Sun. I think I have Ultra Sun, and then I have two copies of Pokemon Moon. But like, I never did like any of the wormhole stuff. Like, I never got all of those guys. So, I kind of want to play it again and do it. Are we gonna have to do a Pika party on stream? This first anniversary is just the start of what's to come in Pokemon. Alright guys, we're a Pokemon Unite streamer now. For September as well, so please stay tuned. Oh, it's Rhinotars in the game? Fuck, dude. I might have to buy. For Pikachu, Lucario, Blastoise, Snorlax, and Sylveon in celebration of the first oh. anniversary. Oh. Oh, fuck. Alright. The Lord Sun is in my home. Oh hell yeah, Ion. That's so sick. That's red. That's red at the top of Mount Silver. <gasps> is this Let's Go Johto and Silver? No, it's Pokemon Masters bullshit. Damn it, they got me every time. They get me every time. And my beloved Sycamore Daddy, yes. Oh, oh, Rosa. Best girl. No, but N. No, Rosa's not best girl. May is best girl. Trainer Lodge. I don't play Masters. Is it actually good? I tried playing it once. This is going to be for the trading card game. Wait. What's this? Looks like Mewtwo's back in the Pokemon Cafe Remix game, and it's hungry. Make delicious drinks and dishes what? your cafe staff to treat Mewtwo what to the a fuck? time. Once you make a lot of delicious drinks and dishes in one minute cooking to fill Mewtwo up, it can join your staff. What? What Here's is Pokemon Cafe Remix? The one minute cooking puzzle mode to satisfy Mewtwo. Tip one. Gather great staff. Mewtwo likes to order oh small God. plates. 
So gather staff that specialize in small plates. Use the Pokemon with little hands to hold the small plates. Bikini, and the newly arrived Latias are good at those orders. Oh, that's so cute. If you want to aim for the high score, try raising your Pokemon staff level. Go to the Pokemon menu to start raising their staff level by training them. Once your great staff is up to the challenge, it's time to begin one minute cooking. On to the second Just trip. keep, on, Just keep mixing. on mixing as much as, much as, you, as can. you can. Once you begin one This is so cooking, fascinating. The Pokemon to rack up oh, combos. I did love Pokemon Troze though. Delicious drinks and Pokemon Troze slap. We hope you'll give one oh, to satisfy to Mewtwo. And there's more. Following Latias, who just appeared today, Latias oh. will also appear in the future. Fuck. Wait, Dude, Hester, I'm sure they relate to this. Hey, Careless. I was doing this the, um, to get and before the Latias podcast yesterday, I was trying to do Giovanni. And, like, it no fucking just kept beating my ass. Available. I could not get, like, his Persian. Like, I'd have to sacrifice somebody to Persian. It Is it terrible that Fue Coco is the only one that looks true? Next up, an update on the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. No, give it to me. Give it to me, you little pokey bitch. Give it to me now. Okay. Okay. Oh, Deerling and Swazbuck. Houndor and Houndown. Those were different formed. Those were different, different formed Wooper. Different formed Wooper? There's a new Wooper! Today we begin the treasure hunt. Travel across Paldea. Paldea? Giraffe Rig? Swazbuck? Mareep? Which means Ampharos is in the game. Okay. Oh, go go. Oh, cute. Uh, the elephant one. Q fan. Psyduck. The Pokemon. Hmm. Hizuki. <gasps> what? That? What the fuck was that? What was that yellow one? Jatini. Oh, we're gonna have to go back through this. Pinchurin. Oh yeah, we'll be hanging out for a few minutes after like this is done, I assure you. Oh man, she's oh I almost want to get Scarlet just for the or no, Violet just for her. With you will be your Pokemon. Journey together. They're so small. Together. Oh, Hatrine's back in it. Annoy that. Wait, who was being traded? Find something to treasure. There's so much to unpack here. And then we have to go to the website. Fuck. There's so much to do today. I think they do, Seiji. Holy shit. Also, hello, my son. Not my son. Daddy, sorry. So it looks like raids are back, in a sense, which makes sense. It's a good. Let the treasure hunt begin. What? What the fuck? We're now starting to get a clearer picture of your adventures to come in the Paldea region. Correct. I'd like to dive a little deeper into the information presented. So let's take a closer look. Just, together. just the trailer. Yeah. We're getting more than a The newest titles in the Pokemon series are the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. These titles will be open world RPGs, a first for the Pokemon series. Show me the Sprawling landscapes and Show vibrant the towns voice lady. Weave together to form the Paldea oh, that region, kind of a your new adventure will unfold. These are the legendary Pokemon, Coridon and Miraidon. You'll rely on one of them as a partner in your adventure. Climb on!
and together you'll dash across grassy fields, move across water, and glide through the sky. Your partner can change forms as needed while you explore every nook and cranny of the region with them. You will be enrolling at a certain academy as a student. And a special independent study project awaits you, the treasure hunt. Through it, you'll embark on a journey to find treasure of your own here in Paldea. Three grand stories are waiting for you. One story will revolve around the familiar gym battles. You'll go to eight Pokemon gyms and aim for the champion rank. In these games, there is no set path you must take when challenging the gyms. Chart your very own course along victory Usha, road. my beloved. The other Satizing? two stories you'll experience hold many surprises and discoveries as well. Which story will you begin with? How will you progress through them? It is all up to you. Professor Sada and Professor Churro, research legends passed on in the Paldea region. Mr. Clavel is the director of the I mean, he's the villain. Academy. We know this already. You can and tell Mr. by the way he's villain is. Your teacher, oh no, Mr. Biology. Jacques is the villain. You can tell by the way he looks. You'll have your battle Biology. loving friend, Nimona. Nimona, best girl. And you'll meet Arvin, an upperclassman and a great cook. There's also Penny, oh. a shy student in your grade. Penny, we must protect her. She's leaders, also too. the villain. Like Grusha, Grusha the is the villain. Gym leader. The people you meet in Paldea <gasps> are sure to enrich your <gasps> adventures. Oh my god, they're all so hot. Why is everyone so hot in this game? Many different species of Pokemon also call Show me the, the Paldea whooper. region home. This Pokemon <sighs> is the Paldean regional form of Wooper. It lives on the land and covers its body with a poisonous film. Fido are delightfully squishy Pokemon that are smooth to the touch. And here's Fido. the Titan, which has a large body and a hard horn that can freeze its surroundings. Of course, we also have the Pokemon from which you'll choose your first partner, Sprigatito, Fuecoco, Fuecoco. and Quaxly. Enjoy meeting lots oh of Pokemon. And complete there was some your other Pokedex Pokemon. as part of your adventure. Oh, Ice Q and Sojourner, that's who it was. Lechonk. Hawk, Hawk player? By using the Union Circle, you can enjoy co-op play with up to three friends. You can go look for Pokémon you haven't yet discovered. Or even ride together to race across the map. The enjoy place. all the Paldea region has to offer with family and friends. That's so cool. Terrastal Pokemon. Terrastalize. The Terrastal phenomenon makes Pokemon shine like gems. What? Yo, Seiji, are we going on an adventure, my beloved? All Pokemon Seiji, in the Pokemon gotta... region are able we gotta, to We gotta fuck this shit up. Which can provide a boost to a Pokemon's type and make its moves stronger. What's the downside? Some Pokemon will change type when they terastalize. <gasps> what type they become seems to depend on that Pokemon's Terra type. For example, an Eevee would typically remain normal type after terastalizing. But there could be Eevee that become grass or water type after terastalizing. We hope you'll try to catch Pokemon with rare Gasly. Terra types. Oh Pokemon my god, that quad have rare battles? Terra types are more likely to appear in Terra raid battles. You can challenge Terra Pokemon in these battles with up to three other trainers. Mm hmm. This is a new kind of I mean, it is hysterical that they just put something gigantic, some dumb crystal on their head, but I'm here allies. for it. Try to cooperate with your allies to get the upper hand in these battles. 
after you successfully <laughs> defeat a Terra Pokemon, you'll yeah, get the it is, but it always is. Honestly, with everything else, this is the like least thing I'll, com I'll complain about. It is kind of adorable. Probably not Seiji. We've kept all the things you love about Pokemon while evolving the adventure you can have in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. Show us some starter evolutions. I want more. We hope you look forward to the day you set out on your adventure. How fucking clue. Or fucking cool. The Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games are available to pre-order at participating retailers now. Mm-hmm. A nose fly. Your Ooh. independent study in the Paldea region begins in three months. We eagerly await your I'm so excited. The fact that you can battle the gyms in any order, which means well, that they have to take into account like how many badges you have. Hey staff, great to see you. Watching. Yeah, exactly. It's so far away, but I can't wait. I can't wait. <laughs> oh my god. Is that it? Is that the stream? Is there any bonus? I don't get my bonus. What is their chat saying? Yeah, okay, we're done. No evolutions, but that's okay. We get EV types. Alrighty, let's take a look. Oh yeah, there's my portal that got done. Let's do... I want to go to the website. Lorge Pikachu Bean. Um, where's the website? Let's see. They had tons of Pokemon characters. Let's see. How do we learn more? Are they not have they not updated it yet? Because there's Pommy. Yeah, there's the explorer that we got. Holy shit, dude. That new whooper. The new whooper looks so good. Like, also, Professor Seda, Milfy, but, like, I'm going Violet, because it's purple. Although... Oof, she a baddie. She a baddie, dude. Yeah, probably. I'm probably too fast. So let's go back through that. Let's go back to the trailer a little bit. Okay. So let's do this. Let's let's go back to that original trailer. Attention, please. Today we begin. This is fucking nuts. Hey, Moxie, how are you guys doing? Oh, Quagsire. If it's even a Quagsire. If it's a new Pokemon, like a new Evo. All right. So I fucking love that we. We basically get to like travel wherever we want, like to go up. Although I will say in any of the open areas, it it does kind of feel like maybe it's like new. I don't know. Cause like who were the new Pokemon that we saw? Like, I think she goes through it here. Them as a partner in your like, adventure. Climb on. And together you'll dash across. So the much fun. Field. This is so exciting. Move across water. And glide through the Was sky. there any other? I think that's the first um, Paldean form that we've seen, right? Is Wooper, which like means that a lot of the leaks, of the like those them. leaks, like it's kind of out. But who cares? It's a different vibe today, Katie. You will be enrolling oh, at a certain academy as a student. Okay, I lost my fucking mind. You guys probably don't believe me, even though you watched me. That's not true. And you guys a special did. independent study project awaits you. Wow, it the seems like they really went out of the box for You'll this one. You'll embark on a journey to find treasure of your own here in Paldea. Real quick, while I'm thinking about it, so it kind of gives me the vibe of um, Jello Apocalypse made this video um, right here called "Let's Make a I... Pokemon Game," and this is such a cool fucking video. If you haven't seen it, I'll post it in Fake Gamers, um, but. This one's re this is a really cool video and he talks about like or they talk about like um all the different stuff that they'd want to do like having like three different routes three like leaders and stuff it's really it, it's very similar to this but like I don't think it's like a, a steely thing it's just like and I like it made sense let's have some fun 
Um, I'll be posting this, uh, this is all being recorded, I'll be posting it on YouTube tomorrow. Like, or it'll be scheduled to go live tomorrow, because, uh, I gotta wait 24 hours with Twitch. There is no set path you must take when challenging the gyms. The Galciato gym. Grusha looks so fucking pretty. Grusha, my beloved. I gotta watch Epiteta Race. The Isn't it any good? You'll experience hold many surprises and discoveries like, as well. I don't even know what's going on Which with that fucking truck. Begin with? How will you progress through them? It is all I don't know, man. You. This is so insane. It's like a dog. Yeah. Okay, wait. Okay, so first of all, this girl right here. This girl right here is hot. I need to get all the character names for all the women in this game so that I can rank them because objectifying women is the only thing I can do as a man. But also, a Pokemon Waifu is simulator, you know? Well, I think, so, if, so here's what I'm thinking, Ion, when it comes to, like, the story, like, the story things <laughs> with Pokemon, is that, um... You gotta add the men too. Yeah, that's true. Okay, I'll add the men. I'll add the men. That's fine. Fine, fine. We'll simp for everybody. Um, so maybe later today they'll have it, and we can do a tier list on the stream before we start Uncharted. I don't know. Um, but she looks like a baddie. Honestly, everyone's a baddie in their own right. But um, I feel like in most games, it's always kind of like when you're working on your gym badges, like it's just that like the stories are always interwoven and you'll have to like stop working on the gym stuff to go deal with like story bullshit this seems like they're like okay we're gonna just separate everything so if you just want to focus on story stuff like it'll probably be something where you need to like there, there might be something where it is gated a little bit so like you might need a certain number of badges but we don't tell you what order to get them in you can do them whatever you want it's gonna be dynamic and then you know we go from there that's what i'm thinking and that way if you want to just do story you can do story and it might be easier to like go do other stuff i don't know this is going to be very exciting i and i hope i believe you should be able to do all three um and like to be able to do them from the get-go is cool professor sada and professor sada. churro research legends passed on in the paldea region is he Mr. hot or does he just have a square jaw of the academy you'll attend Mm. And Mr. Jacques is your homeroom teacher who teaches yeah, biology. I'm feeling like Jacques a villain. You'll have your battle loving friend, Nimona. And Nimona's just and you'll meet A1. Arvin, A1, an like, I a feel like cook. rival the lover trope, you know? There's also Penny, a shy student in your grade. There are gym leaders, too. Like Grusha, the ice type gym leader. Oof. The people you meet in Paldea Her. are sure to enrich Ooh. your adventure. Who this must be the new beauty. That's what I'm thinking. I'm guessing this is like beauty whoever, you know, like the beauty type class. They're unreal hot. Ventures. Ooh. Ooh. She was really or they were really pretty. I don't want to assume. Almost kind of gives me like envy vibes. If the that like that's okay to say, right? Of course. Sure to enrich your adventures. That's just the vibe. I, I doubt it. I doubt it because Pokemon like Pokemon's not necessarily like progressive. Like it's just, you know. We you know, you guys remember the remakes where I was like, Oh, it's cool that we have the different skin tones in the overworld, but not as the actual battle sprites. And I'm like, oh cool. But like either way, they're a vibe. We'll take representation if we can. Many different species of Pokemon also called the Paldea so, region home. I do love like the cute road top. I do like this. It's so cute. I wonder if you, you probably can't sit this anywhere. Pokemon is the Paldean it's my little chocolate whooper. I just want to take a big old bite out of its head, like crush its head like a whopper, you know? It lives on the land and covers you guys want its whoopers? body with a poisonous film. Oh. Fido. <gasps> Are delightfully squishy Pokemon that are Fido, my beloved. Look at this fucking thing. Yeah, I mean, at the same time though, like, we can only ask so much. Like, I'd also just like them to have cool Pokemon in the game. They talk to get the Forbidden Whopper. The Forbidden Whopper. They're smooth to the touch. And here's Satitan, which has. I feel like Satitan is an evolved version. Like, it has a Prevo. Course, That's the vibe I get. The from which you'll your first and we're still 
Sprigatito. Dude. Fue Coco. And Quaxley. I think that we are going to go Quaxley because we got to name him Josuke. Because, like, come on. You know? But, like, at least for the, like, do you guys recall on my birthday, I did, like, the starter tier list. And it was, I don't think there's a single generation except for Gen 2 where I genuinely love all three starters. Like, I always have a gripe with one of them. Oh, except Gen 1. Gen 1 and Gen 2. Um, and I think that was it. I think there's always, like, a problem Pokemon to me. Glen Coco? I don't know. You go, Glen Coco. Maybe. Mean Girls in my Pokemon? I'm here for it. Enjoy like, I hope some of these of girls will be mean to me. And complete I was like, Oleana? Oleana and Sword and Shield? Did work. Pokedex as part of your adventure. So yeah, so that was that was Ice Q and Stone Jorner, I believe. Which like, obviously like, uh, God forbid if they don't have every Pokemon, but like I'm always fine with like not every Pokemon's available. That's fine. Like it doesn't need to be like that. I'm not like a, a national. I do think that there still should be a national dex for like the older ones and stuff. I don't know. Maybe I don't know. Maybe I am bitching. Who knows. Give me that fat pepper. You ever yearn for the pepper boy? Oh, what a f clean animation. What a clean, clean animation for that. Ooh, only Chonk is number 10. Look at them though. Look at that hog. It's my little shit hog. And the multiplayer looks so good. This is so much fun. Circle. Thank you guys you for coming and hanging out. Was this a lot more fun? Three friends. Was this was this a fun time? You can go like look for hanging out you on the uh, like this will be kind of a long or video to post, but like to you get to everyone gets to experience it in person. Like Enjoy all the if you work here in chat, to offer with family and you know, I think it's good. So this uh, terrestrial thing seems a bit weird, you know. Thank you. I, we're not done yet. On. We're still going to see, shine, but I just like do a vibe gems. check. This is clearly like the gimmick. We'll see. It's cute though. Like, I don't hate it. It's a great way to start my day with you guys. So, thank you. All Pokemon in the Paldea region are able to Because, like, which can I think that, like, if there's going to be, like, reveal stuff, like, stronger. I might enjoy doing these kind of streams. Just because it's like. Because, like, will change type when they like for example, if you guys remember, like, I should have done the smash, like, the smash one would have been amazing. You guys could have seen me cry. Or, like, um, seems to depend on that like, Pokemon's I'm not mad type. or anything. I think I mentioned this on the podcast yesterday. Um, but, um, like, the Kingdom example, Hearts 4 reveal came at the end of that whole thing. And since, like, I had already does. known that, like, because people were tagging me that, like, it was there, I was like, oh, fuck. It kind of, like, it didn't punch the same way as if I had just we watched the video. But it's kind of hard if you're not doing it live. So, like, y'all got to help me be on the lookout for, like, when there's live stuff like this that we, like, plan Pokemon it. Because, like, I don't mind getting up early if I need to. Sorry, it's morning for me. It's it's six thirty in the morning. You can challenge Terra Pokemon in these battles with up to three other trainers. This is a this little is a ridiculous. Raid where you can attack like I'm not with like your own timing without having to It's more of allies. like I'm very just neutral. I don't hate it because there's always a Try fucking gimmick. It does feel dumber than giant like Gigantamax and Dynamax. I feel like Dynamax was better because there was different forms. But we also Pokemon, have not seen the that there's different Pokemon. But the yourself. fact that you can basically change your Pokemon's typing is kind of cool. I think that makes like it, it, it adds an extra level to maybe the meta of sorts, you know? Well, actually, I normally wake up around this time. We've kept all the things you love about Pokemon. I normally like get up at about like 5:36 o'clock, start working Scarlet and stuff. And Pokemon Violet. Mhm. Mm yeah, shiny rocks exactly. We hope you look forward to the day you set out on your adventure. Do you know I was all about Pokemon Violet, but like Scarlet's calling to me a little bit. Pokemon Scarlet. And I think that was it. So, let's see, did they open did they update the website yet? Yes, they did. Okay, cool. All right, cool. We got more content. We got more content. All right, so let's take a look. So obviously, like, like Karadon looks fucking great. Uh, 
powers of, that surpass those of other Pokemon, but they're mysteries. So it seems like we get like we meet them relatively early on since we're using them to get around. I wonder if it's something where like we can't use them in battle, like we're bonded with them and it's only after a certain point that they like will allow us to use them in battle or something, you know? I mean, ultimately I'll probably buy both, but I should buy the physical copies. I got to stop buying digital. But um it's a Titan Terra whale Pokemon, ice type. It's 14 feet, 9 inches tall. 1500 pounds and it's got thick fat and slush rush what is slush rush oh boost the speed stat in a hailstorm that's cool strong muscles and thick um mostly just because i like having like the cases and like if i wanted a friend to play it i could just like hand it to eric to try it versus if i buy digital the thing with digital though is that you get it immediately um or like what I had, like Sword and Shield, I bought Sword digitally. And then when Tyler, we had Tyler, we, she bought a Switch on, off of Craigslist. The guy also threw in his physical copy of Pokemon Shield. So like, then that's not a big deal because I have Shield that I can take in and out. But, um, so Titan need to have tough muscles to be able to support their immense bodies and physical attacks using their bodies have incredible power. They also migrate around the snowy regions, protected by a thick layer of subcutaneous fat. So I wonder if that makes him like a, like he's like a, like he's just a, a beefy physical attacker. So he's going to have shit special defense, special attack and speed, but his attack and defense are going to be through the roof. Hey Sin, great to see you. Good morning. Tell Kenny I said hello. Give him a little kiff on the forehead, but we're also recording. So remember that the horn on the upper jaw, that's not to you. That's just everybody, I guess. Um, the horn in the upper jaw freezes the surroundings. Uh, as a titan has five hard horns, among them the horn on the upper jaw. Oh, okay, that's the upper jaw. Is able to gather ice energy, making the surrounding temperature extremely low and freezing the area around the Pokemon. Cool. He's got to be, like, that's got to be level. Oh, I love the little wing, the eyeliner. She's a baddie. Yo, she's your thick eyes, honey. I okay the mouth makes me mad because it reminds me of um especially with this of like the koala pokemon what's the koala pokemon I I, I hate it I don't remember what it's called komala yeah could you imagine I just my brain went like if you get a komala you name it Harris how funny this pokemon has a moist smooth feeling to it oh oh It looks like it was a. I, it's not guaranteed that those were like the actual in game animations, but it did seem like it was smoother than the transition with the spike in Sword and Shield, which was already very smooth. Oh, yeah, the Pokemon's the log. Oh, that's so funny. Oh, also, I got that Destiny mouse in and I got it set up. It is, it is very wonderful. I love it so much. And, like, the cord is not heavy. It turns out that the heavy cord is just from, like, that other one. And, like, it's very smooth and it's got grip and it makes me very happy. So, thank you guys for helping him buying it. Thank you. This is so cute. Sin, like, the whole video. The video will be up on my YouTube tomorrow if you want to watch it. Or you can just watch the VOD. Um, but it's very good. Fido's. I should make, you know, I should make a thumbnail for this video. That might be a fun project to do today is to make a thumbnail. Fido's moist, smooth skin has elastic qualities and is both firm and soft at the same time. When these Pokemon become excited, they intimidate their opponents by puffing up their bodies to appear bigger. <gasps> they puff up. Its breath contains youthful, useful yeast. <laughs> Me. <laughs> Fido ferments things in its vicinity using the yeast in its breath. Said yeast is useful for cooking, so this Pokemon has been protected by people since long ago. Oof. Divorce dads love Fido. It's a puppy Pokemon. It's a fairy type. Oh, own tempo. Is that where like it can't get confused? Yeah. Uh, it cannot get confused. It blocks intimidate. It has its own tempo. It prevents it from being confused. Oh, it's so cool. So cute. Okay. 
Um, let's just take a look at the good old classic. Lechonk is one of the Pokemon used by Nimona, your friend. To find the most fragrant wild grasses and the richest berries. To radiate an aroma resembling herbs that Pokemon dislike. If attacked by opponent style, they will charge forward in a panic. It may appear fat at first glance, but in reality, this Pokemon's body is mostly muscle, built by constantly walking around in search of food. Oh, how cute. How cute. Oh my goodness. My little shit hog. Aroma Veil and Gluttony. Okay. Paldean Whooper. Poison Fish Pokemon. Poison Ground type. Ooh. How many poison ground type? Ground Pokemon. What do we have? Ooh. Actually, this is kind of fun. These are like the unique type combos. Hisui and Zoro and Zoro are being normal ghost. Very cool. The barrel being normal water. Oh, that's right. Drampa. Marshadow. I never got a Marshadow. I need one. Abominable fighting. Is that the only fighting ice type? Poison flying? Really? Okay, poison ground. Wait, wouldn't... What is Skaroopy? Poison and bug. And then what is Drapion also poison? A poison and dark. Oh. So we've only had Nidoqueen Queen and Nidoking King be poison ground, so that'll be nice. Bye, Hester. I love you. You're beautiful, my sweet queen. Please. Oh, my God. Salandis Lazo, okay. Ground Electric. Ooh. I, I have there what are the unused um what are the um unused Pokemon type combo? So we still need a normal ice, fire fairy, ground fairy, bug dragon, electric fighting, normal poison, normal bug, ice poison. Ooh, ice poison, that'd be cool. Bug and dark. Wait, really? We haven't had a bug and dark type. I guess because they, they're super effective. Fighting and ground, normal and rock, rock and ghost, normal steel, fighting fairy. Well, that's just a kid standing up for himself. Fire, ground, poison, and steel. That's so bad. I'm so sorry. I'm a little stinker. That's so cool. I wonder, I feel like it's going to get a unique Evo. Like, we're not getting a Quagsire. Fire Fairy, right? You would, like, for whatever reason, I'm like, why don't we? And it's like, like, Victini would be. Like, I'm kind of surprised that Victini is just Fire Psychic. Oh, I guess it is Psychic, yeah. That's so weird. Okay. They live on land and cover their bodies with a poisonous film. In ancient times, Wooper lived underwater in the Paldea region, but it seems after losing in a struggle for territory, they begin living in bo or they began living in bogs on land. To keep from drying out while living on land, they began to cover their bodies with a poisonous film. Ooh. These Wooper gills have hardened thanks to living all right, the powerful poisons poisonous liquid emits through their tough gills. These whoopers' gills have get hardened thanks to living on land for so long. Their bodies are heavy and they move slowly, but they can protect themselves by shooting powerful poison liquid from their gills. You may see poisoned Pokemon in areas where these people live. Oh shit! No way! So like, you would go and see the Pokemon, like like in the overworld, you see that there's a whooper, you go and encounter another Pokemon, and it's already poisoned. Dude, that would be so fucking cool to like encounter like a dynamic like like the, like they're actually. But that would be so cool. And if you still got water, like poison point would be great on it, obviously. But ground's already we like strong against poison. Water absorb on this thing. Ooh, that'd be good. And then there's more news. Let's see. Let's look at characters. Okay, Arvin. Arvin is an upperclassman at the academy. He's good at cooking and is researching healthy recipes that will help Pokemon feel better, which makes me feel like we're going to get another Curry-esque game. Uh, he will be asking you to help him out since he isn't good at Pokemon battles. Yeah. He's doing his best. What a cutie. Clavel, which, like, anytime there's an older person of importance, they're, you know... 
He acts as the director of the academy, and since you're a new student, he will teach you many things about your school. He can be strict, but he can also be kind. He seems to be a friend of Professor Sada and Turo. What does Sada and Turo mean? Past and future for Spanish and past. Oh, that's so funny. They're so cute with all of this. I mean, he looks sweet. He looks like, um, isn't he look kind of like one of the, the Pokemon guys? Like the, the actual, is that like Miyamoto? Or Mizumi, maybe? I don't know. He seems sweet. Like, I feel like this is the misdirect where he looks like he's a villain. I don't know. We haven't even, we don't even know the evil team. Yo, Grusha hit different. Grusha hit different. Grusha used to be a professional. Grusha used to be a professional snowboarder, but he is now the gym leader of the Glacado gym full time. He is an ice type specialist who has the Titan as his partner. He is usually cool headed. But when battles get heated, he starts showing the emotions he usually keeps pushed down. Oh, shit. We got a femboy. Guys, we got a femboy. We did it. They are progressive. Dude, Gresha is still best girl. Grisha, he's so cute. Oh, my God. Now it's like, yeah, I know I want to know. Is it like, it, are they trans, non-binary? What is the, well, I guess if you're non-binary, you wouldn't use he, him pronouns. You would, just, it would be trans or just choosing to use different pronouns. Either way, it's still fucking cool. Jacques, ugh. He already annoys me because I feel, he, I feel like he's villainous. I don't trust him. Pokemon's gone too woke. Mr. Jacques is your homeroom teacher, and he teaches biology. Oh, I'm sure he does. He is very knowledgeable about Pokemon biology and is the developer of the Pokedex app for the Rotom phone. He has a slightly airheaded side to him, and he sometimes loses himself in his research. I'm interested. This looks like his fucking teacher profile for his, like, school's, like, website. We have some, and even if we don't, like, obviously, fandoms and whatnot will imprint what they want on there, you know. Still might be, okay, yeah, exactly. No, Jacques seems like, he seems like a cool teacher, but he also looks like a teacher that would try too hard. You know? Wait, who did we get a bimbo rep from? I see no bimbo here. I see Nimona, my beloved. She, she looks like, like the, you know, like rival bully to lovers trope and i'm that that's what i am here for oh oh also my character in switch sports since i've been bowling i made her look so cute and she's cat girl odie and she's my favorite find the bimbo are we talking about sada because sada's not a bimbo sada is absolutely not a bimbo you're coming in here and you're going to tell me Professor Sada is a, is a bimbo? You got another thing coming. But Penny, ooh. Penny is in the same grade as you. She has a bit of a shy personality. And for some reason, she doesn't seem to come to the academy very often. She's especially fond of her fluffy Eevee bag and always has it on her back. They better sell this fucking bag. They better sell it. So I feel like... She's going to play a similar role to, like, Bead or Beady, you know? You know what I'm talking about? Ooh. All right, I think I need to go to Twitter, and we're going to tweet. I'm going to locking in prediction. Penny plays a Bead. Type role. Jacques is secret villain. Uh, principal is misdirect. Lechonk, best girl. 
Grisha, my beloved. That boy. Park. Hashtag Pokemon. Hashtag Pokemon Scarlet Violet. She's waxy, my roommate Albin lookalike. She lost a pigment in one eye. Oh no. Oh, she's so cute. I love that Misty. God, how cool is this? How fucking cool. A lounge fly exclusive. Ooh. Penny could be like Wally and have that growth. Oh, that's a good one. Do you think they'd address mental health stuff? Mm. Like, why does she doesn't look? Because she obviously looks, like, sad. Like, yeah, I'm looking at it, you know? We're at them. Clavel. Dude, Grusha? Grusha being a he is throwing me for a loop. That's so cool. That's so cool that they did that. Like, I can already hear some people getting really mad, you know? That's like... I mean, I was down bad, and I'll still say it, like, he's still a fucking cutie. I'm still here for him. Whether he's, whether he's just femboy, or if he's trans. Um, I don't know. Like, I, I don't know. I don't know what... It, I, I'm not as familiar. Or actually, I'm not familiar. I don't know, like, socially, how progressive, like, Japan is, or, like, Game Freak in general is, Nintendo. I don't know if they've had characters like that, but, like, the hair is so fucking pretty. It all looks so good. Oh, Penny, my beloved. Sada. Or Sada. I, I like him, but I don't like his little smooth-ass, like, jumpsuit-looking weeb. He looks like he's caused... Like, he looks like he watched The Matrix and was like, Sada, my Sada, Sada, honey. I'm here. What's up? That's some good tears. Those cis tears. Absolutely. Wow. How cool. All right. Let's look at the, the gameplay. So... It's evolved. Oh, look at that outfit. That looks so cute. Oh my god. Oh, you could, oh, th there's different sized models? I mean, they've had that before. Larvitar, which is amazing. I wonder, Larvitar and Bing, I wonder if they're version exclusives. We need Titar. Oh, Venonat. So cute. I love this. So with the multiplayer, you can, like, hang out. Like, it seems like you can work on stuff. It's probably something where they can't go to the gym with you. Like, you can't do any story stuff, but you can hang out and play. Hey, Kenny, good morning. That's going to be really cool. I'm so excited for the amount of fan art that's going to come out, you know? And that's the thing is I wonder, I really wonder how many people are going to make Femme Grusha without realizing that it's a he. I, I like I don't know why that like tickles me pink. Um, August third. There's a there's a lot here. Okay, so the oldest school in the region. Yeah, here let's go through all of these real quick. Uh, new forms during your adventure, you will meet a legendary Pokemon, either Coraidon or Baradon, which means past and future. Which I guessed, I guessed that, and I was right. And it will join you on your journey. They're full of mysteries that have power that's far as it passes. It seems they have even more forms than those we've already discovered. They're capable of changing their forms to better suit what they're doing or what terrain they're traveling over. So you can use it to climb up, to jump and shit. Like, it's so ridiculous, but I love it at the same time. Hey, Jazz, thank you so much. Have a good one. What is that little orange dude? Wait, which one? I'll have to go back. So they have sprinting build drive mode. Oh, makes sense. If you learn how to ride this, you'll be able to traverse it more freely. It accelerates by generating energy in its tail and its throat. It's transformed the build. Aquatic mode, swimming build. Gliding build, glide mode. How oh, cool. Fight alongside friends. So terror raid battles are a completely new battle format. I mean, not really. Thank you. I'm not hydrating, but thank you. Yeah, my water's in the other room, and I'm not opening up the door. Um, where you will team up. Oh, I gotta hurry. It's almost seven. Fuck. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta start working. Um, I mean, I'm salary. It doesn't matter, but still. The trainers, in order to take on a terrestrialized wild Pokemon within a time limit, 
terror raid battles. You can attack without waiting for other trainers' turns. So it's important that you cooperate. Oh, thank God. Oh, see, this is why you have to go and read these notes and shit, guys. You have to, because otherwise you're missing out. That is interesting. You can attack without waiting. Oh, hell yeah. They're fierce. Okay, so by, by touching shining crystals, they correspond to the tarot type. A sparkling light, making them easy to spot. Because this Pokemon is a grass type, the crystal is also the color. You'll be able to choose Pokemon from your party or from your Pokemon boxes to participate in battle. Merrill's in the game. Um, oh, you do need internet if you're going to do it with people. Okay, so there are three kinds of cheers you can use, and each will benefit. Okay, you can cheer instead of using a Pokemon move. You can use three kinds of cheers for a total of three times. A attack and special attack, defense and special defense, and healing. Ooh. If you manage to defeat it, it will undo the transformation, giving you a chance to throw Pokeballs. How cool. When this comes out, um, it's, uh, it's three months away. So November? Yeah, November. Um, I think they have a release date. They just said it. I don't remember. Like, the big crowned Eevee. I mean, that one looks cute. Like, Sprigatito. Like, the grass ones will have that. The fire ones have that. The water ones have that. All, all Pokemon in Paldea can terrestrialize to gain special power. The tarot type is inactive until it terrestrializes. 18 types, meaning there are countless combinations of Pokemon and tarot types. It allows you to enhance your battle strategies by increasing the power of any moves that have the same type as your tarot type or changing your Pokemon's weaknesses. That's the big one. And gain the upper hand in battle. You can, okay, you can terrestrialize a Pokemon once per battle and it'll last until the battle ends. When a terrestrialized Pokemon uses a move that matches its Terra type and at least one of its original types, the boost of that move's power will be even greater. So that means you could like get like a double stab, maybe. November 18th. Oh, hell yeah. Only select trainers in the Paldea region are allowed to carry a Terra Orb. You need a Terra Orb. Your Terra... Okay, once you terrestrialize a Pokemon, your Terra Orb will lose all its terrestrial energy and you won't be able to use it again until it's been recharged. You can charge it by touching crystals overflowing or go to a Pokemon Center. Interesting. Look the way you want. Um, you can now make changes to your character's eye shape, mouth shape, and more. You can change your hairstyle, hair color, and eyebrows. Look at your best one on your treasure hunt. Ranging from short sleeves and shorts to warm blazers, the Academy has four different kinds of uniforms in total. And additionally, you can collect a wide variety of accessories from boutiques. Wear your favorite items and try out different styles along the way your adventure. That is so cool. Holy shit. See, like, all this stuff is cool. The flying Pikachu is always great. I love that. It can, and it knows fly, which it doesn't know. Two unique characteristics. You will need Nintendo Switch system and connect it to the internet to get this. It, it, ta it takes approximately one to one and a half hours of playtime before you can access the Mystery Gift feature to input the serial code. How cool. Hell yeah. Enjoy it with friends. I think we already did this, right? No, we didn't. Um, um, you could beat Terra Pokemon Terra Raids, sometimes even testing your skills against each other. With a new union circle added to the Poke Portal, you and three friends can adventure together in the same space, cheering each other on as you battle wild Pokemon, or showing each other the Pokemon that walk along with you. There's no single way to play using the union circle. You can wander around together and spend time with your friends however you want to. You can coordinate with your friends. You could all take your Pokemon out for a stroll. You could adventure together. In the Poke Portal, there are two features that you enjoy trading, link trades and surprise trades. Link trade is specific. Surprise trade is just a wild random one. Make lots of trades to find your favorite Pokemon and complete the Pokedex. If you go to the link battle, you can battle with other ones. There's tons of formats. Oh man, dude, this is gonna be so cool. This is sick. Sprawling landscapes and vibrant towns woven in the Paldea region. Oh, wait. Oh, that's the big map. Your adventure takes place in the Paldea region, a land of vast open spaces dotted with lakes towering peaks wastelands and perilous mountain ranges along the way all sorts of trainers will be adventuring and honing their skills with pokemon battles you can find lots of people and pokemon living together in a variety of locations ranging from a farming village with a bountiful harvest 
to a, a poor town with a bustling marketplace. There are also Pokemon living in treetops, rivers, and all sorts of locations in the wilderness, and they're all just waiting to meet you. Ooh. I kind of like that, that it's like a big circle, because, like, it makes sense that there isn't, like, there's part of me that's like, well, how come it's not like a route? But since you can challenge shit in any order, and you can just kind of, like, do whatever you want, like, how fucking cool is that? Dude, the roleplay community is going to lose their fucking minds. <gasps> With the, with the Meowth and then the road on phone um, has several apps and features that come in handy Pokedex is loaded as an app your map is an app you'll be able to see the entire region and your current one nearby towns Pokemon centers wild Pokemon Ooh, the mainstay of Pokemon trainers the outdoor Pokemon center adventuring in the vast Peldia region won't be a walk in a park in order to battle Pokemon trainers and catch them you need to rest many are outside um, you can easily find them from far away. They light up at night, and each of them has a Pokeball sign as the roof. Oh, that's so cool. The Mart, and, the, and they look so cute. Um, oh. <sighs> there are several differences between Scarlet and Violet, and one such difference is the species of Pokemon that appear. Larvitar and Stonejourner appear in Scarlet, while Bagon and Ice Hue are in Violet. <sighs> Am I am I a, am I a Pokemon Scarlet fan now? Am I am I Team Scarlet because it gets Titar and it has Sada? I know. I mean, I don't. I'm not hourly. I'm hourly. I'm. I, it's like I have a meeting at seven thirty, and that's like technically like the official official start. I don't have an official start time. Oh my god! Oh, how cool! very cute oh my god okay all right i think that's it i think i, I think we're gonna call it for today um thank you everybody um here real quick i'm gonna do i'm gonna do the outro thank you all so much for uh watching this this was a very fun stream time um and for the next announcement that they end up doing we'll probably do the same thing so you make sure you join us at twitch.tv slash odipus rex